Taiwan was shaken by a 7.2 magnitude earthquake on Wednesday morning, leaving the nation in mourning with several reported fatalities. The falling rocks, collapsed buildings, and damaged roads have also left 77 people, including foreign nationals, stranded in remote mountainous regions, awaiting rescue. According to the Central Emergency Operations Center, the disaster has led to the collapse of 28 buildings throughout Taiwan, 17 in Hualien County, 1 in Yilan County, 2 in Jilong City, and 8 in New Taipei City. Transport Minister Wang Guocai highlighted the extensive damage to critical infrastructure, including the Taipei's MRT Circular Line, Suhua Highway, and several Hualien tunnels, isolating the eastern part of the island. The reliance on sea transport is anticipated to continue for the foreseeable future. As the most significant earthquake in 25 years, the damage is particularly severe in Hualien. With an ongoing four-day holiday period, officials are urging the public to remain vigilant and informed about safety measures against potential aftershocks. This is Huang Shiho for TVBS World Taiwan.